Mikhail, please calm down. Something is happening here. <laughs> Welcome to Liberty City, I guess. Where are they going? Oh, there he goes. Oh, no. Let's see some ID, huh? You know, carrying a weapon in this town is a felony. Oh. Is it? Got a knife. Got a pistol. Got a shotgun. Got a SMG. No? Really? Nothing? Sorry, man. I can't do that just now. It's all right, man. Don't hit me up when you're free. Because I'm close to a Faust mission. Let's do this, guys. Rigged to blow. Hello. Hello. Uh. Is Mikhail home? No, he's out. Okay. Uh, should I wait outside? No, no, come in. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Sit down. Thank you. You want some tea? Sure. Mikhail doesn't let me use this anymore. Says it makes us look like barbarians. Uncivilized, like immigrants. Oh, yeah? I know what you're thinking. It is a bit funny coming from him. <laughs> he did not used to be like this. When we were young, at home, he was beautiful. He was happy. He made me happy. But um, then something changed years ago. I never quite knew what it was. So many years I wondered what it was or what was wrong with me that I did not see it in him. Or I changed him. Life is complicated. I, I never thought I'd live like this. No? When the war came, I did bad things. And after the war, I thought nothing of doing bad things. I killed people, smuggled people, sold people. And you don't worry about your soul? <sighs> after you walk into a village and you see 50 children all sitting neatly in a row against the church wall, each with their throats cut and their hands chopped off, you realize that the creature that could do this doesn't have a soul. God is very complicated. You mustn't give up hope. Huh. Well, I don't know about that. Привет, Лена. Привет, Дима. What is that? Ah. Uh... I tell you one thing, and you ignore me. Oh. You stupid oh. bitch. Oh. <laughs> Nikobelik, baby. Good to see you. Hey, you too. <sighs> What did you want? Oh, I want you to teach people to listen to you me. You want him to get us the money? Fuck the money. Mikhail, please calm down. We're already in a lot of trouble. I don't know if I can smooth things over with Petrovic. Fuck him and fuck you. Who are you, my daddy? Get the fuck out of my house. Mikhail! Get out! So... What do you want? This prig who owes me money owns a garage in Chase Point. I want you to pick up a truck and take it to him. Call me when you get to the truck. It's in Shotlar on Montauk Avenue. Go. Get out of here. Let's find a truck. Well, there was a 
quite a bit of storytelling uh, back there in the house with that wife of Fauston. Pretty gruesome. With children whose throats were cut and hands chopped off. Yeah, I wouldn't want to witness that. But Nico apparently did. That will change a man, I guess. This is a video game. <laughs> How long do we need to ride? Are we there yet? Pedal to the middle. Okay, we're here. Truck driving. Nice. Mr. Faustin, I have the truck. Drive it over to the garage on the corner of Guantanamo and Windmill. Park up inside. Sure. What am I delivering? When it's inside, trigger the explosive. Should blow up good. Maybe you'll be careful on the drive over. It's pretty volatile stuff. Explosive? What the fuck? <laughs> Let's be careful here. Mm, uh, driving explosives that are volatile. Nice. Just a job for us. Well, maybe it's good we're uh, driving at night. Little less traffic. No, careful. Out of my way, please. Let me go first. Yes, ah, made it. But now for the hard part the end of the road, always busy with traffic. Mm. Yeah, that works. Nico, it's Roman. We should go and get drunk together. Roman, I'm nervous <laughs> enough about driving a truck full of explosives around the city for Mikhail Faust. He's out of control. Anyway, I'm sorry, but if I get drunk with you and then drive this thing, I'll definitely blow myself up. I'll catch you later, cousin. These guys move, everybody. Careful. In 20 yards, turn. Oh, already triggered the explosive somewhat. Uh. Oh, look at that shit. In 50 yards, turn right. Beep, uh, beep. Let me first step out before I trigger anything. <laughs> Is there a car nearby?
Yeah, I want to see the explosion, of course. Oh, whoops. Triggered it. Let's get out of here. Come on. There we go. Nice. Boom. Hey. I had a car down here. Well, look at this. Not a great car. Get out. Forgive me. I need the <laughs> There we go. I've blown the place up. But don't pull that shit on me again. Maybe I don't want to drive around while sitting on an atom bomb. I thought you were the ice cold killer. I thought nothing scares you, man. Pussy. Hasn't anyone got any balls? You and Dimitri, you'd be nothing without me. Nothing. This is how you treat me? Well. Uh, I only triggered the bomb on the way over there a little bit. I don't think I had to. I could have avoided it, but uh, yeah, we survived. Uh, pity that my car disappeared. Now I have this thing <laughs> with a puff of smoke. I'll end this episode. <laughs> All right, guys. See you later. You have a good one. Yeah, what do you oh, want? I yeah. That droid monkey? He is what a good friend want? of mine. He'll be a good friend of yours too if you let him. Anyway, he's got some work and we are in need of money. Meet him at Brucey's Executive Autos on Mohanad in East Hook. If Mallory calls you, we are bowling together. See you later. <laughs> Alright. Next one is Brucey, I guess. Or another Faust. And we'll see. See you in the next one, guys. Have a good one. Latest. Bye.